so in my last video when i showed you the workaround when uh, valorant was not working to add the riot client and the valorant app here so what happened that 90 percent of the people that were having the valorant not opening problem it was solved but for the 10 percent people for these for whom even even after doing uh, adding the firewall settings the game is still unable to launch here's what you can do okay just press windows type view network connection type it in full it's the best way to go there you can see uh, just click on it and this will open up all the network connections that you have so if you have a wi-fi uh, wi-fi will be here if you have an ethernet it, ethernet will be here so whichever one you are connected to it will show you a cable like this here so it is not connected it will show across so the ones that are connected if your wi-fi you will see the name of the wi-fi here so my wi-fi is home sweet home so if i double click on it and go into properties and i go into ipv4 and i go into properties and i click use the following dns server and here you type 1.1.1.1 1 .1 .1 .1 and in the alternate you type 1.0.0.1 and you press ok you close it you close it and you relaunch the game more than likely it will solve the problem whatever i have seen a lot of people messaged me on discord they came there so most of them this problem was solved by using these ip these dns 1.1.1.1 1.0.0.1 okay so this is a cloud dns so by default your ip provider like if you get your net from inter uh, from your x what's the name of the internet provider where design or extreme or airtel or something like that as you can see so if you get from them they use their own ip lookup so you know you know every website has a lookup so google ip address so you will see that google's address is i'm not sure what the google address is home page okay uh, anyways so what happens is once you put 1.1.1.1 this should solve your issue it will not affect your pc in any other way other in fact it will it will only improve the website loading uh, performance what can happen with some call of duty games that use punk buster that they might not be able to connect to the internet so what do you do in that case just remove this so in the same process you go there you go into properties go into ipv4 and you just remove it so simply click on obtain dns automatically and close it the other thing if this doesn't work for the other games you can try this 8.8.8.8 so this is the google one 8.4.4.8 so remember these two uh, try it with 1.1.1.1 it will most likely will, will be solved if it's not uh, drop in comment i will try to make another video